We're delivering on one of the biggest requests we've had on the PSA side, which was to allow for multiple invoice templates that could be assigned on a per customer basis. So let's take a look at what this looks like. Now when you go into your PDF and email template section in the admin settings, you'll see a new tab here for invoice templates. You'll already have one here by default, and this is the invoice template you've been working with previously, which will be set as the default for all of your current customers. Creating a new template is pretty easy. For those of you not aware, all of your templates are fully customizable using our WYSIWYG editor, and we include our stock template for you as a starting point. Now for this example, let's say my only goal is to use an alternate disclaimer language. This tag, here, pulls from the Invoice Disclaimer tab so you can easily deploy a stock disclaimer to all of your invoice templates. However, if you wanted a completely custom disclaimer, simply delete the tag and add whatever language you see fit. Simply set whichever template you like as your default, and this is the template every customer will use from that point forward. But what about instances where we'd want to use the custom disclaimer template we just created for a specific customer? Well, that's easy. When you edit any given customer's record, you'll see a new field here for default invoice template. We'll set this to use our custom disclaimer template, and we're done. Coincidentally, this will change the invoice template for any recurring invoices being billed to this customer as well. Lastly, there may be instances where your customer's invoice template is properly assigned, but you need to use a different template for them on a one-off basis. We've also made that extremely easy to accomplish. When you create an invoice, you'll now see a new field here for invoice template. By default, it will be set to use the customer assigned invoice template, which in this case is using our custom disclaimer message. If we wanted to revert this particular invoice to using our standard disclaimer message, I'd simply select it here. So that's our new per customer invoice template feature available starting today.